I see it coming together. I see it coming together. I see what's going to happen. Khalid Sheikh Mohammed uh, will get a mistrial. He will receive a mistrial because he will his advocates, his attorneys I will say that because of the statements of the president and because of the statements of the attorney general and because of the statements of the White House press secretary that Khalid Sheikh Mohammed will be executed like the blankety blank 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 that he is uh, he will be let off if for not that reason there will be uh, he will be let off because it will be impossible to get an impartial jury or he will be let off because it will be impossible to sequester this jury and um, would you want to be a member of that jury how impartial would you be um, and uh, would it be possible to sequester you um, and if so wouldn't that be akin to torture even worse than the kind of torture than whoever is experiencing what on Guantanamo Bay um, nextly he will be if he receives a mistrial he walks he gets off and then he returns to his homeland a hero Islam will see it as a miracle Islam across the Islamic world uh, who have sympathies for Al-Qaeda who thought 9-11 the bombings were good and who are with, down with them and who are down with more terrorism and who want Israel thrown into the sea the little Satan and the big Satan eliminated they will be rejoicing across the Ummah from, from Indonesia to Morocco across the Indian Ocean across Africa across the Middle East the Islam is going to thunder with joy. And they will become rampant in all kinds of countries around the world, including England and other parts of Europe. He will return to some place like Tehran. Khalid Sheikh Mohammed I'm talking about, okay? Some place like that, some deep, powerful. Iran and Iraq will come together. Bombs will be dropped on our troops in Afghanistan, wherever they're pigeonholed up and surrounded, at Camp Leatherneck and other places. Battleships of the Navy in the Persian Gulf will all simultaneously be attacked. Oil fineries across the Middle East will uh, go up in flames. Any place where the Americans get their fuel from will be uh, destroyed. The troops will be stranded on the ocean and in Afghanistan and in other locations that are in the Muslim world. They will be attacked. And America will be nuclear bombed. And that will destroy so many troops that uh, the United States Army, under the command of Barack Obama, will not be able to bounce back from that. Not for a few years. For all, for, and that's all the years they need, uh, the Islamic, to, uh, to establish their caliphate in Babylon, uh, just as the Bible predicts, just as the uh, Muslims want, just as the Iran government wants. The 12th Mahdi will be installed there, who might be KSM. He might be called the 12th Imam. I know it sounds crazy. And Barack Obama may become lionized himself amongst the Arabs and the Muslims when this, all this happens for helping to do his part in freeing Khalid Sheikh Mohammed. But it will be looked on as a miracle in Islam if it is allowed to happen. If Khalid Sheikh Mohammed walks, it will be a miracle for Islam. It will be, and it will prompt them to spur on their coming miracles that they want to. It's like the 12th Imam caught in the well, see? KSM is the 12th Imam caught down the well. He must be released, saith Mahmoud Ahmadinejad. And Osama bin Laden's family is in Tehran. So he's there too, probably. And uh, they'll all come together, man, in a few years. They'll all come together when, when this trial ends. 
see ya. See if this don't happen.